cross is the place of change. We wear crosses around our neck. Why? Because a cross around your neck or a cross on your wall or a cross in your car, what is it? It's like a stone when we cross the River Jordan. We place it around our neck. We place it in our home because we remember, we commemorate, we honor, we revere. That's the place of change. That's the place of change. So I don't know if you saw it, but it's important that you see it. Jesus touches the man, Jesus cleanses the man, and Jesus says, don't go tell anybody about this. But the man can't keep his mouth shut. He starts sharing good news, and with it, Jesus is driven where? Where is Jesus driven to? Verse 45, it says this, as a result, Jesus could no longer enter a town openly, but stayed outside in lonely places. Someone say lonely places. The story begins with Jesus in the wilderness as an insider in the presence of God. But the story ends with Jesus as an outsider in not a solitary place, but a a lonely place. But isn't this the gospel? That the outsider known as the leper, who was outside the city, who lived his entire life as an outcast, one touch from Jesus, And the outcast, well, he got to change places with Jesus. And the outsider becomes the insider who's clean. And the insider known as Jesus now becomes the outsider in the lonely place. Why? Because the best way I can say it is that the place of change is a change of place. Place of change is a change of place. A change of place, what do you mean, Rich? Yeah, that's the gospel. That Jesus didn't just die for you on that cross. Oh, friend, it is so much better than that. He died as you. This story is not the story of a leper, some guy. This is the story of you and this is the story of me. That every one of us, we are the outcasts. We are the lepers. We are unclean. But thank God for His grace. Thank God for His mercy. Thank God for Jesus in action. Thank God for the gospel that Jesus Christ, He came and declared, guess what? The place of change is the moment that I change places with you. I'm gonna change you from the inside out. I'm gonna take your death so that you can get my life. You're gonna receive my reward and I will take your consequence. Is there anybody out there who's grateful for the cross of Jesus Christ that at the cross, everything changed. At the cross,